Hello, I'm King Posh, your host for today. So, I wanted to show you just the uh, the old stuff. If you don't have a 360, if you had the Xbox One X or the S, and you never had the 360 before, this is what the Xbox 360 looked like. You have your friends there, and shows what they're playing and stuff. Um, this was my games um, that I had. So, if you ever want to know what I had back then, Blazing Balls, you know, Block Destruction, oh yeah, all, all, all kinds of the cool games, you know, from Dust, Fuse, Halo, Harry Potter, Hole in the Wall, oh yeah, Laura Croft, more Harry Potter, Let's Cheer, you know it, Mobile Blast was always a fun one, Mars Forever Landing, I don't even remember that one, yeah. Serious Sam, if anybody remembers Serious Sam, that was an awesome game, Shifters, Sonic, like Mad, Test Drive Unlimited 2. Who remembers Test Drive Unlimited 2? I, I remember playing 1 and 2, so they were both very, very good. Toy Soldiers. Train Frontier Express. I hear they're coming back out with that, so I, I'm excited for that. Oh, yeah. There you go. That's what I had. So, uh... Yeah. Yeah. Good stuff. Anything over here? No, those search for things. So, meet the Xbox One. Oh, I, I've met the Xbox One. I, I don't need to meet it. So now we're going to experience Forza Motorsports 3. And see the difference between Forza Motorsport 2 and 3. Oh man, what an intro. I love that intro, especially with the uh, S15 drifting. It's when Forza realized that drifting was a thing. Too bad they're trying to kill it off. So I hope you guys are enjoying this uh, this series. I'm, I'm, I'm going to go through them all. I'm going to do, you know, Forza... I did Forza 2, I'm doing Forza 3, I'm going to do Forza 4, Forza 5, Forza 6, and Forza 7. Well, I don't have to do Forza 7 or Forza 6, so I'm just going to do all the way up to 5. Oh, 
All right, we got free play marketplace. Let's get right into it. I had a Nissan. All right. Yep. 784 horsepower. Oh yeah. Uh, the memories. 1,026 horsepower, Fair Lady Z. Ah, the good days. Oh yeah. My Hello Kitty car. Oh, Bruce Lee. Yep, Conspiracy Theory, where it all started. Conspiracy Theory Drifters. Ah. Just the memories. Oh yeah, the Magic Mushroom, uh, VW Beetle. Absolutely love these. Oh yeah, this was the uh, <coughs> this was the car I was talking to a few people the other day. Um, where actually the um, the aspiration it's actually got the centrifugal um, supercharger, and it actually gave out more power than the twin turbo. The twin turbo. Um, only had like 900 and something horsepower, but this brought it all the way up to 1,023. It's when the centrifugal force was actually right for once, but they they uh, they screwed up in the long in the uh, in the long run of all the other forces. They never did that again. I mean, it's gear driven and not belt driven, so of course it's going to give you a lot more power. Can't keep up with my uh, my speed here. Yeah, we're not gonna look at that one. She she's almost naked, so we don't we don't we don't want that one to show up. Uh, almost not not she's not, but almost. Uh, I made sure of that. Uh, this is when you could get away with stuff. Um, man, this was the other team I believe I had. Um, Let's look at this. See, but this is this is this was it. Drift and lock. Oh yeah, CTD, still CTD. President, Mr. Posh. Oh yeah. Drift and unlock. Yep. What what amazing times back in the day. Conspiracy performance. Ah, oh, I miss those. Oh, it was just a, such a good time back then. Yep, this was my other uh, paint job that I had running. Uh, oh, it's just so gorgeous. That is just beautiful. Yep. When we were trying to figure out carbon fiber, that's what our carbon fiber looked like. The Sharpie. Oh man, the Sharpie mobile. Oh man. Look how sick this paint job is. You don't see paint jobs like this anymore. I haven't seen anybody on Forza 7 come up with something like this anymore. So Skin Peeler, here is a job for you. Look at that. That is just outrageously gorgeous. Unreal. Man, there's so many great painters back then. Another almost, you know, naked woman. There's so many great painters out there back then. You know, when it first started out, and now it's just, eh. So sweet. Oh, 
Oh yeah, especially when people put the actual cars on the side. Ah, oh, I mean, look at that. I mean, painting, I mean, look, well, yeah, see, she's not naked, but yeah. Um, but beautiful, beautiful, beautiful design. Oh yeah, gorgeous. Oh yeah, she was cute. She's cute. But uh, that, uh, that was that was the times when I was single and everything else. All, all that changed. Uh, I don't run that stuff anymore. There's one with uh, where the, with, there. Uh, oh yeah, high times. Oh uh, yeah, well. Those were the days when you could get away with so much stuff. Man, I was such a kid at the time. Oh, the good memories I used to have. Oh yeah, all kinds of sweet rides. Hello kitties. Oh yeah. All carbon fiber. Well, trying to do carbon fiber. See, I put the Nissan on the side of that. R Rockstar, but it doesn't say Rockstar. Um, yeah. Oh, yeah, this was my favorite paint job of all. Um, this was just sweet. Uh, I just loved it. And too bad I couldn't file share it over to um, the past Forzas because I would be still rocking this to this day if I still had that car. Um, oh yeah, little school bus. That thing is sweet. Oh yeah. <laughs> I remember that time. Oh my goodness. That's hilarious. Oh yeah, the boondocks. Oh, yeah, I've done this thing multiple times. These, I mean, these were just the. This was it. This was the. These were the times, man. The spiker, man. I missed the spiker. Absolutely missed the spiker. This is a gorgeous car. Oh yeah. The good old days. The good old days. I and mean, there's so much more that we, we could just look at, you know? There's that one. Yeah. We're getting that. Let's take you guys around, show you guys everything. Uh, the, let's go to... Uh, Let's go to test drive here. Let's see if I can test drive from here. Yes, I can. So these are the tracks that we had. Back in the day, a full circle so you could drift all you want. Oh, that, that was great. Yeah, a little drag. Dragging. Huge maps. Huge maps. Right. The norms. You know. And then Fujimi Kaido. This was the track that we keep on talking about forever. And we want it back on 7. It was nuts. And there's so many different ways to go down and ah absolutely a blast Iberian test track that was an alright track Le Mans of course Maple Valley yeah 
Yep. Laguna. Magello, which is now back in Forza 7. New York. So many different ways. Yep. The GP Classic. And then the full circuit. And then you could do um, bits and pieces if you wanted to. Alright. Rally. Look at that track. I mean, this is what we had back then. And Forza took it all away and made it easy and open. I mean, that track is a beast. We might take it. We'll, we'll probably take it. Road America. I mean, normal stuff. Road Atlanta. You know, your, your typical tracks that are, are always there. Um, this is Sedona Raceway Park. Um, Sedona didn't exist. It was a fake track. Nope, and you had the drag mile there. Sidewinder. Here's the sidewinders. You see? Layout I. My favorite was Layout G. Um, Sidewinder G was always a, a great one to do. Uh, in my other video on Forza 2, I actually did the uh, did the tracks. Uh, did one of them. But yeah. So Layout I reverse. So yeah, the... This is when, you know, they cared about us drifters. Oh, sunset. Suzuka. Just normal stuff. To scuba. Everybody remembers to scuba. Uh, that, you know, most people remember to scuba. And there's twin rings. Yep. So let's uh, let's remember the past. Give me a drink of water here. Okay. Oh, well, let's turn that down. Hmm, a lot better from, than the other video. And yep, there it is. There's a spin out. I, I, I spoke too soon. I mean, if I can show you guys this too, and I mean, this is what I was running. I mean, honestly, this is just how it was back then. This is just how I ran things. Completely different from what I make today. Completely different. So going from what I make today to this now, um, yeah, it's a challenge. It's a huge challenge now. And I'm not used to it. That's why like everybody's like, hey, try my tunes. And I'm like, this is how it's going to be if I try your tunes. Honestly, I can't do that. I can't. Not anymore. That was the old me. I'm looking for my... Uh, yeah, that's not, not the one I want. I don't even know if the tune's even here. That I that I because I usually have like an, a Sylvia tune I can put on there. Oh yeah, yeah. Let's let's look at that. 
Come on. Go quicker. Okay. Alright. We're not going to worry about that. I just want to, I just want to get by. That's all. Completely different. I didn't even have those. This also sees if the tunes work. Uh, they really don't. Um, at the for the most part, part they don't. Um, but like I said, basic setups. Yeah, that'll be fine. Here, you know, I want to see something. Can I? Let me see something here. Oh yeah, in my drift tunes that I've used by people, created by. There's mine. I have all my friends that are, you know always wanted to you know have me try their tunes. U.S. Legend, uh, Supra. Yep, who's not Supra anymore? Change his name. Not for sale. Laugh out loud. King's Legend, Dragon's Tune, Cliffo. Oh yeah, these are all just great people. Oh yeah. No, I haven't tried people's tunes before. But yeah, this is this is better. Uh much better. Hopefully. Ah, nope. Still wants the still wants to do it. It's telling you, these tunes do not work anymore. Not, not at least I'm not on here. Or I'm just so rusty, let's put it that way. Oh, I just love this track. Remember the countless hours we spent on this trip. Sir. It's like, did everything just turn off on me? Uh, I don't know anymore. It's been too long. Sure I was paying attention to that. Man, the graphics. Ooh, drive straight. Until I get on it. But yeah, that, that's to scuba. Um, good times, good times with the scuba. So yeah. Sidewinder G. I mean, it was, it was such a great, great track. Sedona. Fajimi. I'm not going to do the whole track. I'm just going to do um, Stage D. So.
in my earlier videos way down the list I done the whole track um, I bounced all, all the way up and all the way down but I did it um, so I mean we can race it we, I could I could put a race tune up and show it to you guys that way uh, that's one way to show you guys just what this track is really all about so if you want if you want to see the whole track again let me know in the comments below turn up just because I can just focus on drifting and not really care. Just on that, on just D alone, you know, people just tandeming just down the mountain. Ah, oh, it was so much fun. Uh, there was another track I was going to take you guys on. Not that one. Yeah, you're probably just saying it like, hey, hey, you're going to do this track. And I'm like, yeah, if I can find it again. Aha! This bad boy. Postiano. What a classic. I should use a different vehicle. But why not? Why not? Then I have to retune that car too, so let's not do that. Man, look at those graphics.
was it. Drifting. Just constant sideways, constant. So sad they took out all the good tracks out of Forza. I mean, we got Maple Valley, but honestly, honestly, Maple Valley is just, yeah, this is just better. Oh gosh, I don't remember this. I don't remember it. Uh, there it is. That is a complete black screen. it's over, it's never over. Cobblestone. I'm still in lap one. Just let you guys know. times we would jump that. I remember Super and I would always jump that. It was so much fun. Well, I 
Uh, I was hoping I was going to do that, but whatever. I'm not worried about it. All these little jumps. Slide right into a wall again. It's hard of it, jeez. We've got nothing but open tracks now, and this is just different. Beautiful. Car's all smashed up. Is that it? No. Oh, I see it. It's up there. the line. Yeah, that's such a huge track. I tell ya. Huge track. But these tracks are gone. You know, Forza wanted to make it simpler for everybody, for the racers. They didn't care. They, they started not caring about us drifters anymore, and they took all this good stuff out. So, hey, look at that. It's storefront message. Look at that. I just got 1.8 million dollars. That just means people are still buying my tunes. How about that? Even on Forza 3, they are still buying my tunes. That is that is just that is just crazy. I don't even know how all this stuff works anymore. Nothing really loads up. But, oh yeah, receive my credits. Thank you. Well, how much money do I have? 818 million credits. Yep. Unreal. I didn't put anything on the auction house, did I? <laughs> that I haven't checked in, like, I don't know, how many years? Uh, here's the leaderboards. Uh, you got Tuner. Um, stuff here. Oh, oh yeah, Grid 2 is downloading. Why is Grid 2 downloading? Uh, yeah. It's just how they all get everything. All kinds of stuff. Yep. Well, you can tell who was cheating. Since they were getting 27 million points on, on a drift leaderboard. Uh, no, I don't think that's true. I don't know how this thing works. I think this is overall. Overall, yeah. So these are the overall people. The original 10. And I have like 5 million. I, I don't know how where this is working at. So, I don't know. I don't know how this stuff works. But I mean, I haven't played this forever. And I just really don't know what's going on anymore. Um. Yeah. Yeah, I, I don't know, like, if I can find, like, um, let's see if, okay, I was hoping it would show, like, um, how many people downloaded it, but I don't remember how to do that anymore, but yeah, and that is Forza 3. How do you think about it? Uh, just like my profile things here. 
Uh, total winnings 10 million, online winnings 9 million, current credits 818 million, uh, distance driven at that time 14,000 miles, uh, number of victor victories 1,598, yep. total repairs, part values, garage value is 198 million, I, I went 250. Oh yeah, time spent tuning, 35 hours. Time spent editing and designs, 45 hours. Oh yeah. Test driving, 90 hours of test driving. Man, crazy stuff. I have replays, oh yeah, stage D. Oh yeah, full circuit. Old downhill from, uh, created by Supra. Layout G, oh man. Let's see what, what an old replay was like. I don't even know, I don't even know what this one is. I don't even know what car it is. I know nothing. Hong Kong has more Rolls Royces per capita than any other city in the world. There you go, you learned something. Ah, oh, it was me with Supra. Look at that. Oh man. Yeah. The Supra and I used to hang out a lot. Ah, good times. I'm like wondering where he is. Can I can I can I forward this a little bit? Yeah, skip forward. Alright. Skip forward again. And again. Ah, here we go. When I could drift in this game. One tire on the road. Oh, there's a there's a wreck. Oh, that's normal. That's been my typical day. Man, the damage looked so good back then. See this, that damage for miles. memories of that yeah. I don't even know who Papa Drift is anymore yep full circuit yep Maple Valley might as well show you guys Maple Valley I showed you guys Maple Valley on um, Forza 2 so let's see the changes from Forza 2 to Forza 3 We'll only do one lap. We're not going to do the full three. It 
And I don't even know who I played with on this one. Oh yeah. Few people. I guess you can tell Porsche was a favorite car at the time. I didn't show the bridge. Well, I guess there was no bridge. I mean, you know, the covered bridge, that is. Well, we'll see around this turn, hopefully. Nope, there is no, uh, there is no bridge yet. That, that must be in the next forza. But, uh... Oh, yeah, look at that. Destroying! back in the day. Destroyed. Ah, oh, the good memories. at the time. Now, now you can get over a hundred thousand on this track. But, uh, yeah. I mean, you know, 85, 90, yeah, but hundreds? No. Hundreds never happen. What am I doing there? I don't care. I don't want to know. Oh, I, uh, I wanted to get the perfect, uh, corner again. That's why I went for reverse. Oh, yeah, that, that, those were the times. That was in 2013. Holy cow. Oh, wait, no, that wasn't 2013. It always resets. Uh, yeah, there it is. 2011. Man. 2011. Well, if you guys really want to see Fujimi, I guess I could show Fujimi. Um, the earliest one, 2011. That, that was that person. Full circuit. 2011. I think that's the the earliest ones we have. 2010. Stage D. Man. Stage D. 2010 was the the earliest. Man. Long time ago. Oh. Full circuit. 2011. FTO. Yes, this is the car I was talking about. The FTO. I believe this is what I was, you know. Lap zero. Um, yeah, I don't know what that's all about. But, yeah. Long video, I know. But, um,. This was it. I made it look like an Austin Martin. Because it, it looked like an Austin Martin from the front, so I put Austin Martin badges all over it. I mean, this, I was a kid. And it's a Mishibishi. Man, let's see here. Can I get a better view? I do miss this track.
points though. Alright, do we show points? Okay. Doesn't show points. That's okay. But there was points. I'll show you guys to right to uh, um, stage D and then I'll back out. Um, I don't know where this car is on my list of cars that I own, uh, but I would love to show you guys the tune. And I'm very sure I saved it. This is definitely a lot on the hands, I'll tell you what. This was always a difficult spot 
Especially if you had icy tires. Oh, you just hit every wall all the way down. If you weren't careful. You can see I'm bathing it. I could have made that. I know. I didn't even know I probably said that to myself back then. I could have made that. It's gonna hurt. We'll finish it. All right, this is stage D. Now, I'm not going to be able to find that car. I mean, I have so many cars. <laughs> it, it would take us a while to find that, to find out where Mitsubishi really is. So, let's see if I even have it. So, there's the FTO. It was 6,000 credits back then. It started out with 197 horsepower. Yeah, there she is. He owned four of these cars. Yeah, I know I owned four of those cars. Now, do I do I remember the tune? Now, let's see here. Tune setup, setup manager, low tune. Yeah, there it is. The t 2010. All right, and it goes to 747 horsepower. You know, I think I have enough money. So, here's the tune.
Alright, oh, yeah. it was a positive. Look at that. Crazy. How I used to tune back then. Man, in 2010. Eight years ago. Unreal. Man. And that's how that's how I tuned. And look, I even had it 25% uh, power going to the you know to the front. Um, and as you could tell, that car handled amazing on Fujibi Kaido with the with the torque going to the front. So awesome. Well, hey guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, I'm sure in the next couple of days I'll, I'll, I'll make uh, Forza 4 uh, and we see the differences on that game. But uh, thanks for watching. Um, I hope you enjoyed this show. Uh, if you liked it, please hit the like button. Um, if you're new to the stream you want to see some more of this, please hit that subscribe too. And I will talk to you guys later. I'm King Posh. Peace out.